Hey, good morning and welcome back to the adventure. Today's Saturday and I'm in Hot Gove, Texas, riding in the Gravel Locos rod. Uh, I'm not racing, decided I wasn't in shape to do any racing. So, uh, changed my route to 30 mile route. So I was just getting a little gravel riding in today. A lot of pros here today, as you can probably see in, my, in the beginning of the video. Temperature's pretty good today. I think it's supposed to be in the mid 90s. Uh, but right now it's in the mid 70s. Uh, light winds and not a cloud in the sky. Let's go see what we can get into. I wanna be there, cameras out. Everybody knows that we ignite without a doubt. I want to hear it and see the sound. All right, first obstacle. Got a little bit of a river creek. It's really low. I like it was last year. I can carry your box off. Still people carrying your box off. I can find a dry spot. Good luck. I think I'm going to attempt to ride. See what this thing does. <laughs> it doesn't. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a heck of a lot, heck of a lot easier than last year. That's what gravel biking is all about, ain't it? Okay, a little bit of an uphill here. About halfway through the ride. And the Texas gravel roads are really nice. Not sure how all other gravel roads are, but these are pretty, pretty, uh, pretty smooth. But I'd have never thought it was feels like this not in Texas
at me now Gotta see it to believe it Look at me now Look at me now Look at me now Hey, One Lane Bridge I really didn't know how to take that If I should have stayed on top of the boards Or across the um, underboards I took the uh, underboards Was hoping that it didn't fall through on me There was a big old gap Probably didn't see it in the video But there was a big old gap In between the two boards that run uh, parallel with each other across the bridge. That's probably my tire to get back get down in there and, and then down I would go. So I decided to take the easy. There's your house out in the middle of the country. Got electricity the whole nine yards, so it should have indoor plumbing hopefully. Alright, quick break. Had to change out some batteries in the GoPros. We'll carry on. I think I'm about three or four miles away from the end. It's starting to get hot out here. Temperature's above 80 degrees now. So we um, made it back to the truck 33 and a half miles later. Uh, good gravel locos this year. The weather was beautiful, although it got a little hot. Um, I think when I finally got back to the truck, it was around 95 degrees. Um, probably about the last 10 miles was well over 90. So I was starting to feel the heat. Glad I got back when I did. And hopefully everybody that's out doing the long route, staying safe, getting, keeping hydrated, and uh, we'll make it back. That's it for today. Glad you come out and join the adventure. If you like what you've seen, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so and ring the bell for notifications and we will catch you on 
the next adventure.